The Connected Health Foundry that we've put together really is a stage and proving ground to experiment and invent in three different main areas that we're starting off with. The first is the Connected Hospital. One of the things that I'm concerned about as a heart surgeon is that when a patient comes in and says, here's all my data, uh, I don't have time to go through the data. So being able to focus on how we get that data uh, into the electronic health record so physicians and healthcare uh, practitioners will be able to use that data in a meaningful way. The second framework is around aging in place. Maybe you have a grandfather, a mother who is choosing to um, stay in their home as long as possible. And how can we use at t technologies and other technologies to better monitor and to keep track of the health and well-being of someone that's aging in place in their home. And then finally is in aftercare. So think about someone that's gone in and had surgery in the hospital. Well, they quickly leave that and go home to finish the recuperation. Well, what we're looking to do is how can we bring some of that same monitoring capability into the home in an aftercare situation? And there's a lot of uh, impetus for that around keeping people from coming back to the hospital, you know, that they've deteriorated over the last three days and no one noticed and you know, now they're in an emergency situation. You could see that just like they were in the hospital room. The doctor should be able to visit you while you're sitting in your living room recuperating. How can we use all of these elements to do that? And I think by having the foundry here in the Texas Medical Center Innovation Institute, that allows us to uh, develop these new digital platforms to improve human health.